Taking over as superintendent is a hard job in the first place, but doing it during a global pandemic is no piece of cake. This has been uh, quite an ordeal for all for all parties, for you know, parents, employees, employers. It's a different it's a different game that we're just not used to. He started on July 1st, right in the middle of the back to school planning process. Been an administrator for Gee, many Christmas, 19 years, and everything's the same. And then you dump this COVID-19 on top of it, and it it takes precedent over everything that you know. Minidoka County School District is working closely with other districts in Region 4 to help develop their back-to-school plan. That's why their plan mirrors the Twin Falls School District's color-coded levels plan. We will, according to the guidelines, go back to school August 20th in the yellow phase where we have heightened sanitary protocols. Like Twin Falls, the district will move between levels depending on the amount of community spread in the county. Though the plan could change as we learn more about the virus, the district says one thing will stay the same. The students' best interests are the top priority. That needs to be the end game. I mean, the, our primary goal or whatever you want to call it, but that's that's where my head's at. The school district also has an online option for those who don't feel comfortable attending school in person this fall. The school will present their plan to the school board coming up on August 3rd, and from there they'll begin final details. In Twin Falls, Natasha Williams, Idaho News 6.